everyone and welcome back to Little Book's Great Stories. Do you know what a rainforest is? If you don't, then this is the book for you because we're going to figure out just what a rainforest is. Today we're reading Let's Visit the Rainforest. It might sound weird, but rainforests are actually my favorite type of ecosystem to learn about because it's so vibrant and colorful and full of life. So, make sure to subscribe to Little Books Great Stories if you haven't already, like the video, and let's start reading! Let's visit the rainforest. A journey to a rainforest. Imagine walking through a rainforest. Monkeys howl from the treetops, colorful parrots fly overhead. Howler monkeys can be heard from three miles away. Leaves block the sunlight. The air feels damp. Water drips from the trees that tower above you. Tropical rainforests grow in wet places near the equator. There are also temperate rainforests along coastal areas. This map shows tropical rainforests. Tropical rainforest plants grow in layers. Plants compete for sunlight. The lower layers get less light and have fewer plants than the upper layers of the rainforest. The rainforest can get 80 to 400 inches of rain each year. More rain falls in this biome than in any other place on Earth. Even when the rain stops, the water keeps falling through each layer of the rainforest. But it is not cold in the tropical rainforest. The temperature stays between 70 and 85 degrees Fahrenheit all year. Temperate rainforests are not as warm as tropical rainforests. They are farther from the equator. Winters are long and wet, summers are drier. Temperate rainforests are filled with ocean fog. Water droplets drip down tall trees. Animals in the rainforest there are more kinds of animals in a rainforest habitat than anywhere else on Earth. Many rainforest animals live high in the trees. Harpy eagles make huge nests at the top of the forest. They use their strong claws to hunt for food. Harpy eagles can turn their heads upside down to see their prey. This sloth hides in a tree. Sloths hang from branches in the canopy. Green algae in their fur makes them harder to see in the trees. White bats roost beneath the leaves. They bite the leaves into V-shaped tents to keep dry. At night, they fly and find fruit to eat. Water collects in plants growing in the understory. Poison dart frogs carry their tadpoles from the forest floor to these pools of water. The pools keep the tadpoles safe. This frog is carrying its tadpoles on its back. Leafcutter ants cut leaves from rainforest plants. The ants carry the leaves to underground nests. Fungus grows on chewed up leaves. Then the ants eat the fungus. Animals in temperate rainforests find food on the ground. Seeds fall from the trees. Birds, chipmunks, and deer gather the seeds. In the temperate rainforest, most animals live on the ground. Plants in the rainforest. Plants grow everywhere in the warm, wet rainforest. A kapok tree towers over the rest of the rainforest. It can grow 200 feet tall. It has wide roots for support. Tree branches and leaves in the canopy act like a roof. The waxy leaves repel water. The canopy keeps rain and light from reaching the ground. Most fruit grows in the canopy of the rainforest. Orchids have a strong smell to attract birds and insects. Some plants in the rainforest do not need soil to grow. Flowers, such as orchids, can grow on the sides of trees. Small trees and shrubs grow beneath other plants. These plants can grow with little light. Palms grow in the understory. They have large leaves to catch light and water. The forest floor is very dark. Only a few plants grow here. Leaves and fruit fall to the ground and decay quickly. 
Many trees in the temperate rainforest are 100 years old. Giant fir trees grow in temperate rainforests. Mosses hang from their branches. Ferns grow on the ground. Living in the rainforest. Plants and animals depend on one another in the rainforest ecosystem. Trees and other plants grow leaves, fruits, and seeds that animals eat. Toucans swallow fruit whole. They spread fruit seeds in their droppings. Butterflies and bats drink nectar from flowers. They carry pollen so flowers can make seeds. Birds eat fruits. New plants grow from seeds in their droppings. This green snake is called an emerald tree boa. Animals that hunt need rainforest trees to reach their prey. Snakes climb tall branches. There they find birds, bats, lizards, and monkeys. Dead plants and animals drop to the forest floor. Insects and mushrooms help these plants and animals decay. Everything works together in the rainforest biome. Thank you so much for listening to today's story here at Little Books Great Stories. Please come back again next week for more. Bye!